Let's practice flute. I'm Dr. Matthew Allison, and today's video is going to cover exercise four from 10 Steps for Vibrato, available in digital download or in paper form from the practiceflute.com website. Exercise four is smoothing it out. Steps one, two, and three worked on identifying the abdominal contraction while keeping the throat in an open state, but using very separated articulated pulses or tongueless articulations. This exercise is going to work on connecting those uh, contractions to make a more cohesive sound. So let's just start on a B flat. Uh, feel the quick uh, separated pulses again. Now, feeling the abdominal contraction still, let's not make them quite so separated. Sustain the note, straight tone, and then add those contractions back in. You are in control of what these muscles are doing. Make sure that the throat is staying in an extra open shape as we're applying the abdominal contractions. So first we'll move and apply this with eighth notes. One and two and three and four, breathe. One and two and three and four, breathe. I'm setting the metronome to quarter note equals 60 as we move up the F major scale. One and two and ready. Continue up the scale if you are not noticing any extra throat noise. If you are noticing throat noise, then perhaps slow down or repeat steps one, two, and three. The next part in exercise four is applying the same concept to triplets. So let's play a B flat in triplets. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four, with the very separated tongueless articulation that we learned in exercise three. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. On a B flat, let's just pr practice connecting those triplets. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. So the contraction of the abdominal muscles is becoming more and more subtle, meaning the audience isn't going to see the abdominals con contract when you're playing this on stage. Now let's apply this exercise to triplets, as you see at the bottom of the page. Let's first practice counting the triplets. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. Then on a B flat, let's alternate playing the triplets with very short pulses. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. Now let's connect just like we did with the eighth notes. Again, alternating back and forth. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four. Next, let's look at the exercise, the F major scale at the bottom of the page. I'm going to start with the metronome set to chord note equals 60, which is slower than we've played before. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet. Open. 
bro. Continue on if you are noticing that the throat is remaining open. I do want to look at the last part of exercise four, which is combining the eighth notes and triplets. So essentially, we have one and two triplet three, one and two triplet three. Let's first make sure you're counting that rhythm and let's play on separate pulses beginning with a B flat. One and two triplet three. Now let's apply it to a scale. We'll go back to the F major scale, which is the first one that you see on the page. Chord note set to 40 for now. One and two triplet Lit three. Again, use the charts to track your progress as far as the speed at which you are playing these. I hope this video has been helpful in learning vibrato. Please do subscribe to this YouTube station and check out practiceflute.com for other tips, tricks, and tutorials.